Hello everyone and welcome to Crystal's Crochet Cubby Hole. Uh, I probably won't get a video out today for my mosaic blanket. I have been had to do a lot of running and I haven't got to work on it a whole lot so I'm not sure if I'll get it done today or not. But as soon as I get it done, which will be sometime this week, hopefully, <laughs> if nothing else crazy happens, then I will post that video of the finished product. I'm getting really excited because I've only got like um, two rows on the front part of the border and then two to three rows on the back part of the border because it's a pocket border so I'm doing two borders and then they connect so but I went to Michael's and they had I, I have to check out the yarn every time I go um, they had clearance yarn that was not clearance yarn last week or the week before when all the clearance yarn started at Michael's they have not had this on clearance at my Michael's before now so they just recently, over the last, within the last week, done this. So I'm not sure what it is like at uh, the Michaels where you're at. But I wanted to share. I got up just a little, like three different kinds of uh, cake yarn. I wanted to share with you that were clearance to $5 each at my Michaels. So go check your Michaels and see if they're clearanced or not. But okay. So the first thing is Karen Latte Cake. Now, not all the colors were clearance, but certain colors are. And this one is 8.8 .8 ounces, 250 grams. It's a bulky five weight. Calls for a six and a half millimeter crochet hook. 58% acrylic, 42% nylon. 530 yards. Lovely layers connect collection. So this is the colorway Kissy Kissy. Look at that. It's got grays and pinks. So it's got dark gray and a light gray. And it's got some kind of like a blushy pink color in it. And then over here, um, well, I guess that's just a really light gray. So it's got several shades of gray and then the pink, which, which I really love. See, that's beautiful. And it's got this nice halo. See, can you see the? There you go. Okay, so that was $5, guys. Then some of their Karen cotton cakes, $5 each for cotton. That's a steal. And this is 60% uh, cotton, 40% acrylic, uh, 530 yards, 8.8 uh, .8 ounces, 250 grams. This is the color Driftwood. So I got that one in the color Driftwood. I really like these colors. And then I got one in the color Amethyst Sky. Look at that. That side looks, it's kind of a little unraveled a little bit. But. And this one is a um, medium four weight. So some of their cotton cakes are $5 each. Uh, the lava cake was $5. And then uh, I found a Karen Skinny Cake for $5. Uh, this one is 8.8 .8 ounces, 250 grams, 795 yards. It's a light three. And this is in the color rainbow. Look at that. I love it. I love all the colors. So that's just beautiful. Probably should have got more than one, but uh, I just wanted to grab a few so I could show you what they've got on sale on their clearance. So check your Michaels and see, because um, these were $5 each at my Michaels and they're regular like $12.99 or something. But look, it's got a pattern on the side. And um, it says it takes two balls to make that scarf. And let's see what the other patterns are. Okay, this one is make mittens and it's one ball will make these mittens. And I'm not for sure if that, the, the crochet, yes. So, and the other thing, let's see, the scarf was knit. Now, the scarf was knit, so it takes two balls to knit the scarf. So, I'm not sure about crocheting one, or if they have a crochet pattern for that one. Um, here is a Sunset Dreams crochet shawl, and it takes two balls to make that. That's beautiful. As soon as I finish with my mosaic blanket, I'm going to um, start working on 
uh, Bag of Days um, post virus shawl. So I'm going to make that. So I'm really excited and wanting to hurry and get to making that because I just really want to make it. <laughs> this one has, um, what's this one? Log Cabin Knit Shawl. And it takes two balls. That is cute. I wonder if there's a Log Cabin pattern in crochet. I know there's the quilt, log cabin quilt, which is really cute. So I need to see if I can find something where I can make square the log cabin squares. That would be nice. Okay, so guys, that's what I got. So I just wanted to share that with you real quick. And I'll try to get my mosaic blanket done as soon as possible <laughs> so that I can share that with you. Um, let's see what else. I think that's about it right now. Um uh, I thank everybody that's subscribed to me. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Um, give me a thumbs up. Comment. I love to hear from you guys. Uh, some of the patterns I showed yesterday are, you know, the little pamphlets from Hobby Lobby that I showed yesterday. Um, someone was asking about where to find the patterns on the one that didn't have patterns. I went to the Hobby Lobby website to their, um, what does it say on there? something about their yarn and it has some patterns and I've seen some patterns from some of the other pamphlets I've gotten before but I didn't see any of these new patterns so I don't know if they've just not added them yet I'll keep looking uh, if I do find the patterns I'll let you guys know um, and it did say that some of them you can some of the patterns on some of those you can watch a video a tutorial to go along with the pattern so that would be fun I like watching tutorials that helps me a lot um, I mean, I can read a pattern, but uh, the tutorials are just go faster, I think, for me. So, but that's all for right now. I love you guys, and I hope you have a rest of a great week. And I'll talk to you later in Crystal's Crochet Cup. Bye for now.